Alright, how y'all doing? Major Slack here. Uh, we're playing some more Skyrim, and previously on Major Slack videos, we killed Nyada. Why'd you kill Nyada, Slack? <laughs> Just for shits and giggles. Yeah. <laughs> oh, well, okay. Now, let's get down to some serious business. Oh, we're waiting for Ayala to come on the scene, and I think the best thing to do is just wait till about, you know, 2 or 3 in the morning, and she should come back and go to bed. Right? So let's say da, 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 5 plus 9 is puts us about 2 in the morning. There we go, 2 in the morning. And I think you hear it coming in. That's your bed. I don't think that's how the circle works. They're lording it over us all the time, though. And here comes everybody from the hunt. And there's Ayala. Ayala, got some business with you. I've heard you may actually be strong. Wait, 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 wait. Who said that? I still need to prove myself? <laughs> I just right, want to check something here. Is yep, she's still dead. I mean, uh, sleeping. <laughs> yeah, Nyada's sleeping. <laughs> okay, uh, Yella. Now, if you don't want to suffer the same fate, you better do business with me. Uh, can you train to me? Can you blah, 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 Can you train me to be less of a mumble mouth? No. Can you train me to be better at archery? I'll show you what I know. All right. And I got the coin. Let's do it to it. And I can afford to level up five times. And this one's going to level up my character. No, nope, it's just before leveling up my character. So the next one's going to level up my character. And according to my calculations, or rather according to what I know, or what I've been told by the Skyrim game guide, you're only allowed to level up five times per character level. Uh, so I'm going to get ripped off. For, let me just try something here. Hang on. Hang on. Whoa, whoa, whoa. whoa. Uh, quick save, quick save. God, let's quick save. Okay, now, you there. Come here. Love wait, wait, wait. Can you train me to be I'll better at archery? What I know. Okay, let's just go for it. Okay, so that leveled up my character. Uh-huh. Oh, I could do it one more time. Okay. Yeah, <laughs> got away with it. I'll let's take see my leave, then. Level up. Stamina. Need something? Can you train me to be you better at archery? Times train this level zero. Cool, it worked. Okay. <laughs> I just want to try something here. Until next time. Okay, do a quick load here. Okay, now we're gonna do it the proper way. I mean, yes? uh, the other way. Can you train me to be better at archery? I'll show you what I know. Okay, so level up again. Now our character levels up. Now let's say we exit mm -hmm. and we go level up our character. As in, you know, apply the magicka health or stamina advancement. Okay. So now it's no longer going to see what I'm happens waiting. here. Train in archery. I'll show you what I know. Yeah, you see, you get ripped off. Okay, so we're doing it the other way. There you go. That's what Until happens. So, um, apparently, it. Whoops. Okay, <laughs> I'm so excited. I'm so excited, and I just can't hide it. Okay, wait a minute. <laughs> Sorry about that. Uh, now something. one more time. I'll show you what I know. That was for demonstrational purposes. Okay, so this ever happens to you and you level up, don't exit and then level up your character and come back to training. Because apparently you can get some free times trained on the current level you're on. If you all understand what I'm meaning, anyways, I just demonstrated, so I'm sure you'll be able to figure it out. There you go. So that's all the times I can train this <coughs> level. <laughs> and our work here is done. You cheated, Slack. What? What, what, what cheat? I, I didn't cheat. You cheated, Slack. I saw you. You cheated. It was, what? It was just a little tiny, eeny, weeny, itsy bitty cheat. You know? Come on. Uh, just, you know? Give me a break. Doesn't matter if it was a little tiny, eeny, weeny, itsy bitty cheat. It's still a cheat. Shut up, Pee Wee. <coughs> Alrighty then. So we spent a lot of gold uh, doing the archery training thing with the Ella. Let's get some of that gold back. 
by selling up all the stuff I've been stashing up since the beginning of time here in my home, in Bree's home. And this is pretty routine stuff, so I'm just going to apply the spell of fast selling and jam right through it. Uh, basically, I'm just going to get a little organized here and dump off all the spare stuff in the designated end tables and cupboards and drawers that I have, you know, specially assigned to various items. Just get a little organized. See, this is my weapons chest. So all the weapons go in there. And this is my apparel end table. So all the apparel that I intend on selling goes in there. And this is my special drawer or cupboard that I put all my current gear in. So that's what I'm doing now. It's dumping all my current gear in there to um, increase my carry weight. And I'm just going to dump off a few spare potions here in my potion drawer. And a few junk items in the junk cupboard and spare books in the bookcase and now I'm naked so now we can start selling and my carry weight is increased by almost 100 well pretty much over 100 so grab all these um, weapons and I think I just grabbed some arrows there that I meant to keep and there we go and it's dark nobody's awake so we can't do any selling so <laughs> let's go back inside and take a little nap until morning until everybody gets up and then we can start doing some business and somebody wanted to see what whirlwind sprint looked like in third person so there you go put on some clothes you damn fool <laughs> yeah i get that a lot okay let's get down to business here now here at the war maiden if you access adrian that's who i'm accessing now um, first of all, there's two vendors here. There's Adrian and then there's Ulfberg inside, okay? And typically they share a gold supply, but you can have them have a separate gold supply if you access Adrian while she's outside the shop, okay? So you can like essentially double the supply of gold available to you for selling stuff there if you access Adrian while she's outside the shop, okay? So that's what I just did there. And so we emptied out the inventory and we're back at Breeze Home taking on some more stuff. And next stop is the Drunken Huntsman, which is the shop across the street from the War Maiden, right here. And we can sell some stuff to him. And what happens next, actually, when I exit the Drunken Huntsman is pretty funny, actually. I get accosted by a courier who is, lo and behold, also naked. I've been looking for you. Sorry, buddy, I'm spoken for. I'm supposed to deliver. Your hands only. Oh, is that all? <laughs> Let's see here. A letter. Not sure who from. He wouldn't say, just that he was a friend of yours. Looks like that's it. Got to go. Uh-oh. <laughs> There's John Law passing by. <laughs> Good day, officer. Just a couple members of the loincloth local going out for a leisurely stroll. <laughs> Nothing wrong with that, eh? <laughs> All right, onward. Back to business. Let's sell a few more items to Ulfberth and bottom out his gold supply. Take it right down to one dollar. There we go. And it's up to see Bellathor and bottom out his gold supply. And take him right down to one dollar, <laughs> or rather one septum. And now we have no choice but to go up to Windhelm. And I'm just going back to Bree's home and grabbing some more stuff here. Here's my cell end table. This is end table where I keep stuff for a I'm sure I'm gonna sell and taking on some dragon scales here and dragon bones and I went overweight so I'm just gonna have to put some back and that's it and now it's off to Windhelm where there's a whole bunch of vendors that we can take advantage of uh, but while we're here we might as well just go into the inn and rent a room You're naked. <laughs> Yeah, I get that a lot. <laughs> Got some fresh baked bread and good cheese. Uh, if no, I'm not really eat. hungry. Just want to rent a room. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. Thank you. I'll show you to your room. Right away. <laughs> what was that? That? Oh, that's just a little something I do to avoid getting busted while I'm running around naked. Ah. <laughs> and back to business here. Just take a little nap to uh, get the well-rested bonus and to um, put ourselves. Um, first thing in the morning when all the vendors are open and it's out to the Windhelm marketplace and sell off all our stuff start bottoming out everyone else's gold supply here and if you ever hear at Windhelm first thing in the morning and the vendors should be there but they're not just wait an hour and they'll drop in <laughs> and then you can carry on <laughs> 
So let's continue to do business here at the Windtail Marketplace, bottoming out all the vendors' gold supplies. And if you do that and you still have stuff left over, don't forget Sadri's used wares on the other side of town. You can sell some stuff there, all right? And we've only got a couple items left, a couple of stolen steel shields that I took on by mistake. So I'm going to have to go back to my home in Bree's home, dump them off in my new stolen items end table, which is that one there. That one there. And that's about it. i going to take on all my stuff again, get dressed again, because I have enough room to take on all the rest of the items I want to sell. So get all geared up again. There we are. Looking all nice and spiffy. And set my hotkeys for my I am your weapons. Sword and and your we're ready to rock and roll. Now I'm preparing for uh, the next bit of business I want to take care of after I finish selling off all the stuff. And that is I want to do some enchanting. And I want to take on a couple of necklaces and a ring. So I'll grab a silver ring here. And a couple of silver necklaces I've got stashed here, right there. So I've got those, and now we're going to have to take a nap, a long nap, two and a half day nap, because everybody's maxed out. All all our vendors that we typically visit are, you know, they've all run out of gold. So let's just sleep a couple days, and then back to the next morning after that, and all the vendors in mm -hmm. White Run will have resupplied their gold and be ready to sell off all the rest of the stuff we got on board and then get on with the other business we want to do which is some enchanting some smithing and some potion making all right back to business does she buy dragon balls i don't think so i don't claim to be the best blacksmith in white run where's your cell screen Raymain's got that honor man's steel is legendary yeah, yeah yeah all i ask is a fair chance have you met my father Oh, you have I, to be at the. I okay, do. come this way. Don't forget to check inside the shop if you need it. Walk this way. Walk this way. Atta girl. Yeah. I'm pretty sure she doesn't buy dragon bones, but I just want to make sure. Okay. You here? Punched I in. My father more. You think all now the I have stuff for sale. The finest weapons and armor. Yada yada yada. Miscellaneous. Whoops. Hmm. Blades, helmets, pretty much anything. What's the menu screwing up? Needs. Down to miscellaneous. And all she wants to buy is my lockpicks. No, I want all my lockpicks. Okay, that's that. Alright, be careful. Sorry. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh wait, I want to talk to you. Little fucking brat. Come here. Come here. Come here. Wait, 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 wait. You. What are you looking at? I'm not afraid of you, you know. Even Listen, you little rug rat, I want you to stop bullying my buddy Lars, okay? Yeah, why? Because if you don't, we're going to chop you up into little pieces and send you off to a giant's camp where they eat little girls like you for breakfast, okay? Alright? Okay, okay, I'll leave him alone. All right. I was just kidding around. Besides, if he'd only kiss me, I wouldn't have to beat him up all the time. No. I mean, this is all because you got a little crush on the tyke? Oh, jeez. Yeah. You done? Yeah, yeah, okay, we're done. All right. Ta ta now. Be good. Stay in school. Don't do drugs. Uh. Let me know if you see anything you like. Okay, I gotta do this strategically now. What have we got left to sell? This I should sell to. Um, yeah, I should have sold that down there while I was down there. Anyways, we'll get to that later. Okay, sell dragon bones to this dude. Everything's for sale, my friend. Ev Trinkets, odds and ends, that sort of thing. Okay, I got some nice fresh dragon bones and dragon scales for you, my friend. Only been used once. How many? How many can you take off my hands? Four. And... Can you take some dragon scales? No, you're maxed out. Okay, so let's see what we can do in the way of apparel. How about a banded iron shield? Can you handle that? Just barely? Okay, you got eight gold left. If that's it, you're maxed out. Ta ta now. Come back. <laughs> um I doubt very much are getting just double checking here. Got something for just about everybody in here. Oh yeah, you got Give stuff to grab. Have any questions. 
All your freebies have respawned. Okay. First of all. What do you need, my friend? Got a pretty full stock of potions and alchemy reagents. Oh, you do buy dragon bones and dragon skills. Okay, that's good to remember. Okay, uh Well. So I'll double those. And you can take one dragon skills. Great. Excellent. Come back anytime if you need a remedy. I think it's time for Mr. Burns. Excellent. Thank you, Mr. Burns. Now let's grab all the freebies, and for this I'm gonna go into first person. It's a lot easier. And apply the spell of fast grabbing. <laughs> yum 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 Done and done. done. Alright, let's get out of here. Okay, so what do we got left to sell? Uh... <laughs> it's magic, kid. <laughs> I don't claim to be the best blacksmith and the finest weapons and armor. Okay, um... Where's that? This thing here. Elven... No, no, I don't want to sell that. Oh, I'm sold out here. Okay, sell this. That's it. Just double checking here to make sure he didn't sell something I shouldn't have. Arches Helmet Elches Ring. Actually, I don't need this anymore either. Yeah, let's sell her that. Yeah. Don't forget to check. Have you met my father? He's a stu- Hmm, blades, helmets, pretty much anything to suit your needs. Selling the archer's helmet because it's been replaced by Croesus. Although th this can be upgraded. Where's... Well, it doesn't matter. Okay. Croesus can be upgraded too, but not as much as this. Anyways, I'm, I'm decided I'm going to sell this. So you go. And that's that. And we're done. All right then. All right then. So, just a little overweight. Uh, just double check and see what I got on board here. Got some junk. Got some chores, chitin, and three dragon skills that will sell for approximately 240 septums altogether. We could take that down to our good friends in Riverwood. What am I doing? Map. Think Slack. Think map down in Riverwood. There we go. Oh yeah. Yeah, let's get on over to Lucas. It's been a while since I've been to Riverwood. Here. <laughs> Lucas, my man. Oh, you got some freebies too. Sweet. Let's Thank grab these up. Thank you so much for taking care of those thieves. Hey, no sweat. The Riverwood trader is back to the way it used to be. Steal, steal. Take. Lucan, I was thinking we should have Take. a grand sale. Lower the prices by half, maybe get some jugglers. We could attract lots of new customers. <laughs> That's a good idea, Lucas. A what do you sale think? To attract new customers? Camilla, everyone in Riverwood already shops here. There are no more customers. Hmm. I like to see some well, jugglers. Maybe we could go on some sort of trip. Take the wares on the road. Get some new customers. Yeah, what do you think about that, Lucan? Camilla, really? You don't have better things to do? Because I can certainly find quite a few tasks. Ah, don't okay, be such a spoiled okay. sport. Just trying to make this place a little less boring. Yeah, that's right. You're a closet you boring. Can... The Riverwood Trader is everything you need in a general store. Okay, let's do business. Oh, a bit of this and a bit of that. Yada, yada, yada. Dragon scales. Got some nice dragon scales here for you, looking. Only been used once by a little old lady dragon that was terrorizing the town of Kynes Grove. How about it? There you go. And if I got anything else. We're done. Check a gold supply. Sweet. Next time. Are these freebies? <laughs> 
See, this is an example where you should start listening to your sister there, Lucan. She is coming up with good ideas. You, on the other hand, are giving away gold. You know what I'm saying? Huh? Huh? Okay, next. Uh, what do we want to do is go back to white... Let's hang on. Let's just check our way here. Yeah, that's just the way we like her. That's good. Apparel's good. Potions are good. Knock your books. A couple of junk items. We can dump them off at the breeze at Breeze Home. That's it. We're done. All the business is done. All right. Thumbs up for the slack. Uh, what? What? Oh shit! Ah, dang it! Got to take down a dragon. Trying to do business here, dragon. Shit. You are definitely not a hardcore slacker. Okay, uh, chicken chick quick save time. Thank you all very much for watching, and uh, join me next time on a Dig Down a Dragon. Yeah, I, I